Welcome back to Ship Gear. Today we will be driving a 3000 liter of gasoline truck with James May in it off a 50 meter ho ramp into an exploding gas station. It's going to be crazy but we don't have James May because he is praying he will survive. So let's get to it. The tricky thing for us is it's completely unrehearsed and we've got one shot. There is one take. The goal of this scene is to have a petrol tanker drive down the runway, hit the ramp and land somewhere in here, but he's going to fly through some giant pyro that's been caused by the stick. He doesn't know how to fill up a car, right? So he splashed petrol everywhere. As the vehicle slides into the petrol station, we're gonna set off everything, everything. It's gonna look like something out of Transformers when everything blows up. We've got kerosene, we've got petrol, we've got solid fuels. We're even using bags of flour that are gonna be wrapped around some explosive charges. Because as soon as that vaporizes, it's gonna go bang and create lots of flames. The weather's really been playing games with us today. Um, and there's so many elements that are weather dependent, not only just the stunt itself, um, the cameras that are in the air, the drone that's flying around, but also things like this is a very busy scene for pyrotechnics. Um, and obviously we're looking at the wind direction, where the wind's blowing and the effect that that's going to have on all our cameras and all our people. We have a 30 minute window to debag all the cameras to protect them from the rain, trigger the explosives, set the car at the end. It's like an impossible situation. We shall now present to you James May's death. There we go, damn it. The sun came out a little bit but it's dawn.